Hi guys, my name is Firefly and welcome back to a brand new series in Timberborn. This time, this time, we're going to be playing with the Iron Teeth on hard difficulty on Thousand Island map. Now, I just made a sort of a little bit of a challenge. So, I don't know how the Thousand Island maps work. I've not even seen it yet. So, hopefully, this will be a nice little hard challenge. Hopefully, hard makes it harder as well. I do see that you get longer um, droughts, so it should be fun, it should be fun. All right, we're going to call our town Die Hard because that's what we are, or should we call it Hard Boiled Egg or Hard Boiled? Nah, Die Hard sounds good. All right, pause because we need to make sure we're doing everything as efficiently as possible. Look at all of these islands. They don't call it Thousand Island for no reason. Oh, this looks like a nice big area. Ooh. Ooh. Can this be filled up with water? That would be good. Um. Oh, so it comes from here. Oh, are we gonna make a big dam? We are gonna make a big dam. I would say like this. Going across, starting from here. Would even put some more levees here to make it higher. That will supply us with an abundance of water. Look at these scrap islands. Cool, so I've never played INT before, so this is all new to me. Um, I haven't even watched it on YouTube. <laughs> I haven't even watched it on YouTube. So let's take a look at what we're doing here. I know when it comes to breeding, it's a little bit different. So you've got a breeding pod. Iron teeth preferred and only way to produce, reproduce. You need to this faction. It needs water and berries. Okay, a barracks. So, um, that's not too bad then because the one thing that I had a problem with in the first season was I built too many houses and it got overpopulated and we just ran out of resources. But this time it doesn't seem that bad. Okay, let's get some wood because we know we definitely need that. Um, for now we can put one. Let's get some berries going. Uh, like this and this. I don't know if I should put two, but hey, we live and we learn. Let's get some roads going. Right, now I heard the droughts can be up to 30 days long. That's a lot of droughting, <laughs> if that's even a word. Oh, that's different. An efficient way to store logs. It can be, things can be placed on top of it. That is pretty damn good, if you ask me. Small warehouse. <clears throat> yeah, let's get that flowing. Um, What else do we need before we start up? We need some water. Because I have no idea when the next drought is coming and how long it's going to be. I know it doesn't go max straight away, but it's going to be hard. And we don't have much resources. Look at that, 90 berries. So that is something we need to get on top of as fast as possible. In fact, let's get a little farmhouse going as well. Then what we're going to do is we're going to prioritize what we need to prioritize. Carrots is the majority of the thing I need right now. So we'll do that many carrots. Put some pathways so everyone's happy. Um, so how many have we got? We've got five unemployed. Now these can die. So we've got to be careful with that. We've got five unemployed, two in the district centre, that's seven. We've got four children growing up. So that's going to be one, one, two, five there. I mean, seven, so we need another two people. Okay, let's prioritise this, 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 and these for now. And then we need to look at housing. Housing. I'm not too fussed about it straight away. 
let's get that there and maybe one more because this island doesn't look like it can hold a lot of people a lot of beavers not people beavers are people too all right nothing okay yes we need to start cutting don't we where is it this one all right let's put all this area for cutting good looks good all right let's speed it up a bit looks good got two beavers in there let's take a look at this uh pod because it does take five berries and five water which is something i really don't want to waste right now i think i could i should just pull it down and turn it off until it is needed so let's put that down but that's going to be late priority they don't really need it right now so let's get everything built up okay so we have most of it built up now now we have a drought and i just realized something i have no idea how i'm going to keep all this water um look at that drought coming in yeah i'm gonna have to build so many levees and um dams just to keep water around here in fact, this is uh, building a dam here is more important than I realized. I need to just keep water flowing at a slower rate, but flowing. Now we've got a four day drought for our first drought. Not too bad because these will die out in two days. So yeah, <laughs> they're going to die out eight days. That's not too bad. These already died. These trees, 12 days. Okay, so we should be able to survive the first drought now the house is nearly built which gives us basic needs of sleep and shelter shelter is important because it increases life expectancy and i need them to live as long as possible because i'm not reproducing anyone at the moment um to reproduce though we will need a campfire or a roof terrace rooftop terrace i think i will just get a campfire i think i'll just get that for now Let's get that up and running. Um, I'm going to take my time to build this one because I am not going to be having 12 uh, beavers for a while or 20 beavers for a while. Our stock of berries is not too bad. We should be able to survive and our water is pretty decent. So we're getting there. We're getting there. We've still got 2.3 days left. I do want to build science as fast as possible because it's quite important. Because I want to start getting things like platforms and levees. Hmm. Hmm, yeah. So I want to start making water come out a bit slower. So I'm going to put maybe one... Definitely going to put one here. Or shall I put it across here? See, water drains from multiple different places. Now, I don't know how this is going to work. Here would be perfect. Here and here. I don't know if I can reach there yet. Let's try and get pathways going. Um, what is that looking like? It's because of this bit. I don't really want to destroy these two because they provide me resources. Um, maybe go around. No, I don't think that does anything. Does it? Uh, okay. You know what? Let's just dig this up. Let's just dig this up. It's not that one. It is this one. Let's destroy this. Yes, and let's make a pathway straight to that, and we can destroy that. So now, yeah, that gives them a decent amount of space to move around. 
Now we just need to get through to maybe here. Is that okay? I want to get this small gap because I don't. Wanna, I want to use as little wood as possible. So maybe I'll start here. I'll do it here. Let's let's arrange it. So I don't want dams, I want levees. We need to get science going. Alright, so we survived this first drought. We've got no food, so that is a worry. If people start dying, we will not have um, enough to reproduce. Oh, we're reproducing already. Okay. That's not too bad. But they're hungry. We've got a farm going. We've got two people in there. Hopefully, we can get this done and dusted. Let me take a look at these. That looks so weird. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sure there's some sort of um, ethical thing with that. We produce them outside as well. They're totally exposed to the elements. Okay, so they all seem to be dying of hunger. <laughs> I just didn't have enough. Um, I don't know what I could have done differently. Now I do feel like this is going to be a bit of a, uh, a bust. So most we're going to have to restart this one. I am going to keep breathing halted. Okay, I am going to keep retrying until we actually get a stable colony going. Um, I need berries. We just used up all our berries. Maybe because I put it in here. Maybe I wasn't meant to do that yet. Or maybe I was meant to get the farm up and running a lot faster. Maybe that's the first thing I need to do. Because how long does it take carrots to grow? Four days. We had about four days before the first drought. Died of hunger. What's my population like? Three adults. <laughs> two adults oh is it the end is it the yeah they're not going to grow in time okay let's get back to this point and um let's try again okay so i'm back and we're hitting up our first drought of this town this town is now called die harder 2 or die harder actually not die harder 2 but die harder is the second iteration of this town. All right, so we're already doing it a lot better. Um, we've got carrots rolling in. We've got a lot of berries. I haven't started reproducing just yet. They will start dying of old age soon. I know that. Um, we've got science rolling now and we should have enough water. I do want to get a little bit more water in there just to work. There you go. All done. Now they're building this. I am going to pause this for now. In fact, I think we're okay. Because we've got carrots coming, I think we're okay with um, using the berries for reproduction. I do want to be careful with water though. I do really want to be careful with water. All right, let's get another house in, in here. I don't have much wood. Ch starting to clear up here. I want to delete this stuff. And that way we can start making a path and going back to my original plan of doing that. Now I do need science to increase extremely fast, but I just don't have enough people to be working on multiple different science projects, is what I call it. Um, we're getting free about every, wow that's long, every 10 seconds it seems like, which is not a lot. <laughs> and we need at least stairs, which is 70. And we need levees, which is 120. So we need at least 180. This is nearly done, which is great. Uh, how's food looking? Food is not looking too bad, actually. We still got 2.3 days. It was a four day drought again. I think that's the standard for a um, first time drought on hard. I'm not sure. I, I would love to block this off with uh, levees here and put um, dams along here. 
But damn, it's cost so much wood. We definitely need a forester. <laughs> we definitely need a forester. How much research is that? 60. It's not too bad. But we need planks and we need power for planks. Which is bad. <laughs> um, power. What power do we have? We have a water wheel. We also have a power wheel. Now, I think a power wheel, a water wheel would be better. But I don't know if this is thin enough to make a, a, a good flow. So if we put that like, I could put it like that. Could put it like that and set up a little um, lumber mill there. Oh, we nearly did that. We've nearly done that. That's going to be done soon. Let's change the priority of that to this. All right. What are we on? 0 0.9 days. Food looking amazing. Water looking absolutely fine. Let's start reproducing. Let's start growing this town. Okay, so we've pretty much just left the first drought. Look, these are only 35% grown. It's been about nearly a day and we've already got another drought. Already. <laughs> this is absolutely insane. This is absolutely insane. Um, I've started paying out where I'm going to put my uh, dams. And then once we get the research for levees, which is the first thing I'm going to research, not got much left, I am going to do that because we need to slow the water down here. Does that need planks? It doesn't need planks. What does need planks? Stairs needs planks. And forest needs planks, doesn't it? Okay, that's why I'm building planks. But yeah, I don't know. I don't even know if this is going to build in time or how, uh, grow in time. I hope so because we literally have no food. Water is not too bad. I hope so. I hope so. I really hope so because. We really need to survive this next one. This is brutal. This is absolutely brutal. All right. What do we need to do next? I guess for now, we just need to start making sure that we're a little bit more stable. Now, this doesn't have any berries, so it's going to be halted. This is fine. This is getting done. Okay, that's all right. Oh, man. This is going to be crazy, but... But good news, <laughs> we've we've managed to get six in, what is it? What is this called? Population well-being. Well, it was six, but hunger's going a bit because we've got no food. Like, mm, I don't think I've made enough carrots. I feel like this is going to be another bust. I feel like it's going to be another bust. Maybe I should have made more carrots. Maybe the goal is just to make loads and loads of food. But we're going to check that out in the next episode. Thank you so much for joining me on this brutal journey. We are going to do it. The first season took about three tries before we got it down. This one, I think we can either get it on this try or the next try. So I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Peace.